Well, last year I know I filmed a short video clip of a mother robin who had built a nest here on top of the radiator of this F-14 farm all. Now this year, over here on an F-20 farm all parts tractor, nature makes use again. Honey beehive in the gas tank. I've been watching them now for about oh a month or so. Looks like they're doing fairly well. I'm not going to disturb them or destroy them. I'll let them let them survive and hopefully thrive. Thanks for watching. Okay, I've been getting this gas tank on this F-20 farm all ready to take off. I got an appointment with the beekeeper about 7.30 towards the evening. So I think he's wanting me to assist him in cutting off the bottom of this tank. We'll use a pneumatic die grinder and just zip one side of it off and hopefully be able to get inside and get the queen. I'm just real interested in seeing what the, how much comb is inside this tank. Alright, we'll roll some video when the beekeeper shows up. Looks like you have more bees living in there. I don't even see any comb. It's all on the other side of that baffle. Yeah. Well, now they're starting to get pissed. Whoa. Oh, I'll hold that for me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to use my zoom instead. Hey. Wait me, I'm just... That's where they're at, in that bottom half? Yep. Is there honey in there now? Some. I'm going to drive my truck up here if that's all right. Yeah. They are mad now. Boy, they're just everywhere. Oh yeah, he, he made them mad. Okay, it's just about 24 hours since the beekeeper split open the gas tank. And last night after he did that, we had quite a few bees still in this half of the tank. And what he had done was to set the front section ahead of the front baffle. inside this regular beehive. So it looks like all the bees have worked their way back here to the existing hive still in that end of the gas tank inside the wooden box. So he's going to come get that tonight or here soon. So. That'll be it with my part of beekeeping. <laughs>